Hello guys, uh, it's Traveling Edmon here. I hope you subscribe to my channel. So, this is the tram to go up and down in uh, Harder Comb. You take it from Harder Bound Station, Interlaken. Uh, it's a good view from the tram, guys. You pay 40 franc or 40 euros fra to get up there. But it's worth it, guys. It's very nice. I highly recommend Harder Comb, uh, Interlaken, Switzerland. So look at the view, guys. Uh, it's clear from the tram because uh, it's transparent to glass. And I had really a good time there. I chilled there for quite some time. So that's 40 euro guys, uh, you can take the cable car from Harder Bar Station. So if you like this video guys, please hit share, it will help me a lot. So that's me on the tram, uh, I was on my own on the cable car. So that's the top of Harder Cone guys, uh, you can see the lake of uh, Interlaken, there's a very good restaurant there but it's quite expensive, uh, a little bottle of water costs 6 euro so uh, it might wise to, to bring your own. That's the view of the restaurant from the platform. Uh, there's plenty of people there taking their videos, photos of the view. Uh, it's so nice. I chilled there for around 3 to 4 hours coming from uh, uh, Ari Gourds. So uh, that's the platform guys they have built for you to have a very good view of Interlaken. I think that's uh, uh, 1,300 meters something if I'm not mistaken if I got it right so people are just chilling out there as it is very relaxing view guys <clears throat> So that's me there guys. So that's the restaurant which is very good. Delicious food. That's the platform that you have to queue for you to have your own selfie and video there. So that's the view from the tram again guys, uh, I was going down, uh, I didn't, I wasn't able to arrange this is in order but uh, what's the point, <laughs> yeah, after all I have a very good view and I enjoyed it a lot, it was a good weather as well. Uh, 
uh, you see a lot of this in there guys uh, I didn't know how much it cost to yeah uh, to rent that one it's quite risky though you got a machine in it and you can control it but I think you need training to use it uh, that's the view It's a nice place to chill guys just forget the bills it's once in a lifetime unless you really wanted to go back there so that's the paragliding it's a lot in there So if you want to ask something guys comment on the comment section if I can help that's the climax of the uh, your journey guys the spot where you have to queue There's always a lot of people in there. That's a good view on top. Uh, that's the restaurant uh, on the right. And as I've said, it's not a cheap restaurant. After all, they have to take their goods through the cable car. you can see that guys it's a close-up uh, they love to get closer to harder cone platform so people would see them as well it would be nice to be seen by other people so that's the view from my uh, drone guys I was able to fly my drone there I just have to get somewhere where there's not plenty of people uh, I wasn't I was hesitant in the fir uh, first time but when I see somebody playing with his drone so I took mine out and uh, let it fly why not as long as you didn't get you don't get closer to people uh, especially if it's windy but fortunately when I was there it wasn't that windy uh, the wind was manageable so I had a very good view of the platform and of harder calm itself I think my adventure isn't complete without it flying my drone so that's me uh, <laughs> having a good picture or video of myself that's the platform guys and that's the view of uh, two lakes between uh, uh, Brins or an interlocking uh, Bunijan not even sure that there's two lakes connected by uh, a small river So that's the platform guys 
uh, that's your peak of your uh, journey in uh, Hardercombe, Interlaken, Switzerland. And for those who are asking what are the attractions in uh, Switzerland, I highly recommend Hardercombe. Uh, from the Interlaken, you have a very good view as well. Uh, clean lake, uh, you can even swim, take a swim in Interlaken or Bunigin, Inter uh, Switzerland. So that's the restaurant. Look at the view guys, it's so relaxing. So, I just have to <laughs> uh, bring the drone closer again and again. Uh, I'm not risking it to take it very far. That's the cow there. Uh, I don't know the significance of cow in Switzerland, but they got plenty of it. And uh, they have small bell. So, every time the cow will move, the bell will make a sound. And I think that's the way they monitor uh, the cows or where they are So there's somebody having a good uh, picture on the spot on the corner So that's uh, Bonigan like guys and That's the aerial view of the restaurant and if you like this video guys uh, please share and subscribe to my channel traveling edmund here thank you for watching and if you subscribe it will help me a lot uh, cheers guys that's harder switzerland